This program is supported by Main Street Bookends of Warner. For books, toys, games, cards, gifts, and a gallery of local art. Main Street Bookends of Warner. Welcome back to Yankee Chronicle. I'm your host, Abby Peel, coming to you this week from the Lake Sunapee Region Chamber right here on Main Street in New London. Come on in and say hi. I'm now joined by the president of the board and the regional manager at Ledyard Bank, Katie Blake. Oh, I'm so excited for you to be the president. How Thank exciting you. since January. Yes. That's very exciting. How are things going and what's new here at the chamber? Things are going wonderfully. I'm very excited to have taken over the board seats. Yes. Um, I've been on the board for about four years now, but just took over, as you said, as president in January. Right. We, dive right, we dove right in. Um, we have a great board, so right. there's already been some significant traction with activities thanks to our board members and, of course, our executive director, Ashley Rowley. Yes. <clears throat> so really my hope is just to continue with those efforts, community awareness, community involvement, all of those good things. And it's so exciting, too, that now life's a little bit back to normal, so it makes your job a little bit easier as board president to be able to say, all right, what fun things can we do now? And there's no real limitations, which must be great. You're so right. <laughs> Thank God things are somewhat back to normal. Yes. And as you know, in this community, we're getting into our busy times. Totally. So we are... Um, Ramping up to do, you know, New London Hospital Days, yes. the Black Bike Golf Tournament. So yeah, a business after hours, ribbon cuttings, all those exciting in-person things that we haven't been able to do for really a while. Really exciting. Ribbon cuttings is one that I always thought was kind of sad that needed to go away for a little bit because as a, as a business person in town, you want to be celebrated. That's so exciting to open your business and you just couldn't do it. So it's so great to have everything back like that. Absolutely. Yeah. And I mean, obviously the business openings are still happening, but right. that quintessential moment of, woohoo, we're here. Here's our ribbon cutting hasn't been happening. And celebrate so. as the chamber. Absolutely. Talk about being a, a chamber member. What A business out there that's always thought about it. What's the benefit? Why should someone join the chamber? So it's interesting you asked that because we're really taking a look at you know our 250 current members nice. and we're always looking to build that <laughs> um so we're also working with Ashley to develop member 101 sessions which basically basically will be sessions where folks can learn just that yeah you know why be a chamber member we're always looking for new ones it's really about um we serve 12 communities which people don't really know right. so it's just creating awareness about your business having exposure to other businesses and other resources having Ashley as a resource yes. so a lot of people just don't know the ins and outs of what that means yeah and we're working to create more exposure in that. That's fantastic. 250 members, that's wonderful. Mm -hmm. and, it, and talk about those 12 towns. I mean, why, why is it so beneficial for somebody who has a business or is starting a business to have the support of 12 communities? Because it's such a big reach. Yeah. You know, a lot of chambers are one to two towns, whereas we're, we're lucky enough to serve 12. Right. So whether it's Warner, you know, Grantham, New London, so right. there's just so many opportunities and so much more exposure. Right. One thing I talked about with Ashley a few years ago was all the work she does with other chambers in the state, mm -hmm. which I think is always a really interesting thing, too, that people don't really think about is she's in contact with Claremont and Concord and can use resources and resources for the members, too, which is fantastic. And she does just that. Yeah. She reaches out to all of her chamber peers and, you know, collects information, bounces things. They work collaboratively together. Yeah. Um, and it just adds that much more continuity yeah. with this chamber. Well, one topic we love here because we host the parade is hospital days. Yes. And we'll be here before you know it. I Anything know. fun you want to tease? I know the planning stage is no. just <laughs> so obviously our, our favorite event is Meet the Chamber Night. Yes. You know, we're working on coming up with a theme, you know, that kind of coincides with the theme of the Hospital Days is. Yep. Um, that's our favorite event. And then we're thinking about maybe incorporating one or two new things, but Fine. we're still trying to decide. Okay. Well, yeah. I know it's still a little <clears throat> early, but it, it gets here before you know it. So it totally does. Yeah. And obviously it's we May. love it. <laughs> I know. It's I know. so crazy. <laughs> Anything else exciting happening you want to plug here at the Chamber? I would just like to say that, like I said in the beginning, we have an amazing board of directors. We have a, a really diverse group of leaders, uh, business leaders in the area, but we're always looking to fill a couple more spots. Okay. So I just encourage if there's anyone that's interested, reach out to myself or Ashley and um, fill out that application. Talk a little bit about uh, being a board member too. What are the benefits of that? We have an amazing board. I think I said that once yeah. or twice already. Um, you know, the commitment is one board meeting a month. Yeah. It's on Tuesday mornings from 8.30 to 9.30. Okay. Um, it's, it's pretty, you know... Um, consistent as far as like what the expectation is for that Good. and then just being a part of different types of committees and being prepared to assist in any other areas that need it. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Well Katie Blake thank you so much as president of the board of giving us the rundown <laughs> and uh, I'm sure we'll talk again soon as the seasons change. Here. I'm sure we will. Yeah, thank you so thank much you. for having me. If your business is not a member of our chamber join up and take advantage of their many programs. 
When we return, we'll get a rundown of the shows and happenings for this summer at the New London Barn Playhouse. But first, these messages from another one of our underwriters that makes your Yankee Chronicle happen. <laughs> 